Hello and welcome again to another tutorial on GameMaker and in this tutorial we're going to uh, go over surfaces and what that's going to do for us it's going to allow us to uh, shoot bullets and bullet shells will come out and they'll stay on the ground forever or we could also do body parts too okay so what a surface is basically you can almost think of it as a sprite and uh, we're actually changing the sprite so we're drawing, uh, basically stamping pictures onto this big sprite, uh, and yeah, we can update it. And so when we want like a dead body or dead limb or bullet shells to be just on the floor, staying there forever, without the game constantly having to update their position and stuff like that, we can just paste it, basically, or stamp it onto a surface. And the surface will keep it there forever, and then just one thing will be complete. Will be drawing that, so we save uh, time. So we'll have this in our control event, and I think you you can only do this with Pro. So people with non-Pro, the free version, or I guess it's called Light, uh, you're not going to be able to do this. Sorry. So make a new variable called Surf, and let's say equals a new sur okay. surface. Surface create and then the width and height is how large we want this surface to be. So how long? So we want the surface to cover the whole map. So it's going to be room width and room height. So basically the the height width and height of every of uh, this surface is going to be the width and height of the room. I'm not able to spell height. Okay, there we go. Uh, yeah. Okay, so now after we've done that, um, we have to just do some dirty work or just house housekeeping. Uh, just draw set color. Oops, color, and set it to white. Okay, and then draw. Actually, blending mode. Blending. Oh. Okay. Draw. Set. Blend mode. And then blend mode. Normal. Set the blending mode to normal. And actually, this one thing I forgot. Yeah. And uh, draw. Set. Alpha. There we go. And then. We wanted to set that to 1. And draw set alpha, that value is a uh, number between 0 and 1, 1 being uh, completely opaque. And so that's our dirty work, our house keeping. And now it's time to do, or to draw our background, or the actual ground. And so I have a texture that I got that I'm going to uh, import in right now so I'm gonna pause the video and come back once I got that imported okay I got my uh, texture here it's nice like ground texture or uh, dirt dried dirt now oops wrong one <clears throat> now we go in here and we're actually we're going to uh, paste this to the surface basically uh, I'm gonna make it all ground so it's gonna say paste background to surface, and the way we're gonna do this is we're gonna do a surface surface. Uh, no, no. Set target surface. So this is basically saying, okay, uh, we want to draw something on it. And then anything after this will basically be pasted to the surface. Uh, we're going to draw background. And we want it tiled. So, yeah. Background tiled. Background is background zero. And then X and Y will start. There, that should be good. Uh, I'm gonna make sure I'm not missing anything. Yep. So 
we just have to tell it what background we want to draw. Uh, where we want the top left corner to be is going to is going to go out right and go down uh, on the bottom. So it's going to expand to the right bottom corner. So we want it to the top left corner. We want to start it at the top left corner, which is uh, zero zero. And then we want to reset the surface to do that. Just surface reset target, and that doesn't require any arguments. So basically, this is going to just paste our background uh, throughout the whole map. And that's pretty much that. And then for drawing, pretty simple. Uh, you just have to draw the surface. So I'm going to draw the surface on the bottom because we want this to be the ground. Actually, before this, so we want it to say draw surface. And we're going to put draw surface. Uh, where is that? Yeah, draw surface. And we just put our variable ID in there. And then we want it to start at the top left corner. So there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and test this. I'm going to pause the video until it's ready to load. OK, so it's done. As you can see, uh, there's this texture, the ground texture beneath us instead of that just boring gray stuff. Uh, so now that, that's a good sign. We've got the basics done. Everything else is working, pathfinding, uh, the crates breaking. OK, everything's fine. It does seem a little bit laggy, uh, which is really weird. It might be because of my I'm recording. But yeah, so that's a good start. Uh, next thing, we're going to create our bullet. And so I'm just going to name it object bullet. So this is just going to be the thing that flies out of the gun. And it's just going to eventually slow down and stop. So create a new event. And and I am going to just uh, make two new variables called speed and friction. Uh, it's pretty self-explanatory. Actually, you know what, the speed variable is not. Uh, OK, never mind. So the speed variable is built in. So if we set this speed variable to any value other than 0, it's going to go in the direction of the direction variable, which is also built in. And we're going to set the direction variable uh, in, in the man class, or the object man. And uh, the reason we're doing that is so when we shoot the bullet, we can get the position, the angle of the man, and get uh, like a 90 degree angle of that and, and uh, get a random direction depending on the angle of the man is facing. So we're going to set the speed to random 3. So it's going, it can increment by 3 plus 2. So uh, the lowest it can be is 2, and the highest it's going to be is 5, and then friction equals 0.25. Okay, good. Everything's good. Uh, now we're going to put a step event and we're going to make if speed, I forgot to put a statement, if speed is equal to zero, then we're going to uh, update the surface, draw the bullet sprite, and destroy the bullet. So, first thing we want to do is surface, uh, surface set target and we want to set the target to control dot oops object control object control dot surface oh surf I think that's it and then yeah that's actually it then uh we want to draw the we want to draw the actual bullet onto the surface so Wait, where is it? Draw sprite. Draw sprite. Uh, draw sprite extra. So the first one's the actual sprite. So that's going to be the uh, image index. No, that's not going to be image. Sprite index. Sprite index. Uh, 
image index x y x scale just have that one for now uh, rotation image angle color uh, just have that as null negative one for null and alpha is going to have one so that's going to be our drawing script for that and uh, we're going to end this with a surface reset target there we go and instance destroy In instance destroy which will destroy the bullet and we're running out of time so we're going to continue this in the next tutorial so thank you for watching uh, please subscribe appreciate a rating and see you in the next tutorial thank you